Shahid Bashir. In this video, I will tell you something about the operationalization of the variables. This section has a very strong connection with the literature review. As we can see, as per our example so far, we have gathered four independent variables, one mediating variable, and one dependent variable. So each variable had several factors and this theoretical relationship will be evaluated through a proper survey questionnaire. So based on the factors of each variable, we are going to make a proper survey questionnaire. So this section has something particular related to explanation of how we gonna make the survey questionnaire so as we can see that this section clears up confusion about the meaning and measurement of the variable okay this is the first thing this study includes four independent variable okay this is what i already told you so all the variables were measured using five point liquid scale ranging from this is this the following subsection will provide details of research instruments used to measure the variables in, uh, involved in the study. So now, until now there is one question, five point liquid scale will be used to measure each factor of the variable. So in the latter section or in the latter video related to the research design, I, I will explain, I will explain why five point liquid scale is good for conducting a survey questionnaire okay so this is as you can see the first independent variable so if you can say that uh, in online context the concept of okay this means that this so what we exactly mean from the perceived performance risk fear of a purchaser of not receiving the actual product from shopping website so in this particular study we exactly mean what perceived performance risk is so this is a 10 statement indexed so this 10 statement index was chosen for this study for its ease of administration and the simplicity of five point liquid format. The researcher used three statement statements adopted from study of this person, two statements each from studies of Hong and Yi and this 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 this, this. so so this is from where and where it was taken. So okay same like the other okay the online purchase intention which is a dependent variable this is referred as a cognitive component that mediates the relationship between attitude and behavior so okay these are the measures these are taken okay to clarify this i have made one table also so what does it mean our variable which have 10 items what does it mean we have 10 questions and uh, these questions are adopted from this is this, this and uh, okay now what i said earlier this is a strong connection with the literature review so all these sources are already discussed in the literature so now just just see this statement lower in quality than that advertised so if you go back 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 in our literature so hope i'll be going right so see lower in quality than the advertised so which is if you see the the oldest one the oldest reference so now other might be inspired from this oldest reference so okay coming back again okay 
see what I said inspired from this one so hope so one question 10 items that are going to be uh, so in simple words 10 questions to measure these variables will be asked from the respondent so now just just have a look finally if we if i have there at the end hopefully so yes i have so i i just wanted to show you the question uh, 